If a client has a mental health diagnosis, um, we want to help bridge the gap between mental health services and the criminal justice system. In Jackson County, when someone with a mental health issue enters the legal system, they have the opportunity to work with probation officers who specialize in providing the resources and support needed to keep them from reoffending. This is called the Mental Health Supervision Program, and we have a talented team of individuals at the Community Justice Department who help make this program a success. Why is a client normally put into mental health supervision? If a client has a mental health diagnosis, um, we want to help bridge the gap between mental health services and the criminal justice system. We want to be able to assist them in addressing any barriers that may, they may have, and we do that through um, assisting them with their needs and really using empathy and adapting to the situation that they might be in in life. What are the goals of mental health supervision? The goals of our department is to reduce the recidivism, and that's true for every client. Um, however, working with um, clients with a mental health diagnosis, we really want to make sure that we're reducing barriers for them. Um, we want to do that through collaboration through community partners, providing wraparound services, and um, really providing the best resources and services that we can. Um, we want to be able to case plan with clients and develop goals and teach them um, you know, social skills that will last long beyond the time that they're on supervision. What type of training does a probation officer involved in mental health supervision get? POs receive a variety of trainings to help assist clients with a mental health diagnosis. There's um, crisis intervention training, de-escalation training, um, different uh, cognitive behavioral intervention trainings, and other evidence-based trainings that we receive. Um, we also work closely with community partners to ensure that, you know, we're all kind of speaking the same language and we all have the same training. Um, and we are, you know, getting those needs for those clients and reducing those barriers. How do you define success for a mental health supervision client? As a PO, um, we need to meet a client where they're at, and every client has a different definition of success. If we want to measure success, it's really about like making sure that there's a reduction in recidivism, increasing stability, um, having a client meet goals that are on their case plan, as well as collaborating through community partners and um, allowing clients to learn skills that create lasting change.